So today I'm going to be talking about One Night at Puffy's Clap Shack and regarding like if it's still coming and a possible release date. So I would like to announce that it is still definitely coming. It's just since Scratch 3.0 came out, I have to learn Scratch again. So yeah, but anyway, it is going to come out. It's definitely not cancelled, by the way. There is probably going to be three games in the series, so that's a good thing. There's not just going to be one or two, or, but three games, which should be pretty good. So anyway, I just like to bring this up because a lot of people are like, where is One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack? Well, I'm still working on it. It's a work in progress, and a little bit on the bad news, but One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack DLC is cancelled only because that game, let's just say, was a mess and didn't work at all, let's just say. But because it had so much conflicting storyline and it, the, there was so much bugs in it and it, the graphics didn't look that good, so I decided to redo it so it's not DOC. And DOC didn't make sense because there was no game in the first place, which DOC means downloadable content, so it like made no sense because DOC, you have to download from the actual game, but there is no actual game. So it made absolutely like no sense, I guess I should say. But anyway, yeah, that's why that's cancelled. But the game's coming along pretty well. I just finished like the camera button, which works pretty well, I should say. All of the characters are like the same. There's no like other characters. There's still Puffy, Pedro, Sammy, Spotty, and Shammy. There's still all those main characters, which is nice. It's gonna be like it, I'm taking it off of my original concept which I made when I first got into Scratch, that concept was good, it just wasn't fully flushed out because, you know, I was new to Scratch. But now I can fully flush that out since I'm much better at Scratch, I would say. And yeah, the graphics will be updated, it will be no glitches. I will release a demo once night one is done. There'll be three nights night one, which is the main night, which I'll release a demo for once it's done with the animatronics and everything. Night 2, which is like a bonus night, which has a lot to do with the storyline. And Night 3, which is custom night. So, Night th night 3 doesn't have a lot to do with the storyline, but it has a little thing if you beat the hard parts. So, anyway, the name is going to be One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack Opening, g basing off of what I already decided to make. It's the opening because, like, it's the opening of the first establishment of Puffy's Crab Shack, which is nice. So... I get to start on like a fresh slate, I guess. It also means opening for another reason. I'm not going to tell you yet, but you'll figure out once the demo comes out. You'll understand once the demo comes out. There's two cutscenes that really hint at something, I should say. Um, but yeah, that's, it's really going to help start off the storyline with... And it's going to help explain how all these anomalies, let's just call them, happen. And One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack 2, I do have the name for, and it will be called One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack 2 Chambers. And I won't say it right now, but it is underground. It takes place underground, hence the chambers name, and there's tons of different rooms that you'll be able to move into. But for One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack opening, there's two rooms. One, like, general office area, and another one is, like, a control so the area, um, One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack 2, I don't really know much about since I'm not even working on it. But that is the name, One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack 2 Chambers. And it's going to have like five, six rooms to go in, so it'll be very fun. It's going to be very lore-based. Both of the games will be. Every game will be, so make it interesting. So anyway, I just wanted to give you guys this quick update because, you know, a lot of people have been asking in the comments, What is One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack? And then the reason I did delete all my projects except one is because mainly all those projects on my Scratch account are like teasers for stuff that I don't really, the games cancel, like when I did Puffy's Crab Shack DLC, and a lot of them are like old stuff, so I took those down and I left the one I did Puffy's Crab Shack opening, but don't worry, I didn't quit Scratch, everything's good, Scratch 3.0 is out. Yay, I'll be doing a review on Scratch 3.0 tomorrow, probably, or whenever, probably tomorrow, whenever you're seeing this video, it doesn't matter, it might be out by now, but 
yeah, I'm going to be doing that. It's going to be quite interesting because I'm going to talk about a lot of topics like how one item, how, sorry, how Scratch 3.0 isn't the best, but I like it. But anyway, we're not going to get into that. You can watch the other video. But yeah, One Night of Puffy Scrapjack is still being developed. No need to... Everyone, just calm down. It's Everything's okay. I have not quit Scratch since I took down all my projects except one. It's coming along quite well, going off of my original concept. And yeah, so there'll be a lot of lore in it. And yeah, if you're wondering if Ahmed is in it, he is, but he's not like the main dude. So to say, should I say that? One thing that is annoying is what's slowing progress down a lot is all the stuff from my backpack in Scratch got deleted with 3.0, which sucks because like all my models of all the characters are gone, so... Yay. That is taking a while to get them back, but right now it's going quite smooth. It's just a little bit of a setback since Scratch 3.0 deleted all of that, which is quite annoying, because that's all my models. But at least I didn't, at least I wasn't like 50% in the game and then all my models got deleted, because I'm really good. I've created the office, I've created it so it's like, it's a scrolling office, so that's good. I hid in some Easter eggs already. It's the original office from back very long ago, except it's like revamped. Like I'm doing a, Essentially what I'm doing is a makeover of One Night of Puffy's Craft Shack, like my original concept. Just improving like everything, just making it all better. And yeah, probably better for the experience. So anyway, that was my notice about One Night of Puffy's Crab Shack. It is still good. Everything's fine. I didn't quit Scratch. Just wanted to bring that up since a lot of people in the comments are saying that. But I didn't. Everything's good. Little setback because it deleted my stuff, which is annoying. But, yeah, everything's good. And if you're wondering about One Night of Puffy's Craft Shack 3, I don't have anything planned for that yet, as it's still very far away. But, trust me, it will be pretty good. So, yeah. Anyway, on that note, guys, I'm not going to make this video 10 minutes because I don't even monetize my video, so it doesn't even matter. But, anyway, guys, bye! Sorry, I almost forgot, but what I did want to mention is for every three Scratch videos, so I did one a week ago and one today, for every three of those, and I'll do another one, there'll be one Fortnite video, so only one, so three Scratch videos and one Fortnite video, so yeah, that's kind of how I'm going to go off with my setup, so anyway, sorry for that, and...